Hello everyone, welcome to my 2020 Department 56 Dickens Village. I posted a pretty short video of this about a week ago, and someone requested to do something a little more slow and in-depth. So I've never narrated one of these things, and whenever I put music behind it, it gets deleted. I'm really not really so experienced with this stuff, but anyway, here goes. There are two main squares one on either side of the, the village. This one was a set that I expanded a little bit with some additional walls. And there's uh, 11 or 12 buildings around it. That was a limited edition accessory set back in, I don't know, 96 or 97 with uh, Charles Dickens reading A Christmas Carol. And uh, I've swapped out the center of that three or four times over the years, and now we have that tree there. Originally I think there was a fountain as part of this set that I put somewhere else. It's uh, pretty symmetrical as I'd said, a square on each side and then there is a bit of a side street, a bit of a side street, I'll come back to these. And then this platform in the middle I purchased on Etsy. It holds five buildings and accessories. It's, it's pretty neat. The wires all run underneath the buildings and up front there are um, cutouts so you can do your lamp posts and run the wires underneath and not have those showing. And this park here I'm most proud of. Uh, for quite a few years I didn't have much going on here, just a collection of people milling around in some road and I decided we need something a little, a little more special, more of a focal point and uh, I created this park using the, the brick sidewalk and creating these um, cutouts in the middle that holds the, the the shrubs and some trees. And again, it's symmetrical. I've got a bit of OCD. Ran the uh, the wires to the lampposts, threw them on the bottom. So again, it's it's nice and neat. And if anyone wants a part list for this, just, uh, just let me know. The only animated piece, oh, and I see that it's actually not working. All right, well, didn't notice that. We'll have to take a look. This is the second square. Um, these are you know, brick kinds of, I forget what they called them, accessories from quite a few years ago. Just kind of laid them out into this shape. And again, I'd be happy to provide a parts list for it. Uh, I upgraded the lampposts a couple of years ago. And see some of them, they look like they're out, but they're actually on. It's kind of strange how the uh, the power to them varies. It just must be the way that I, that I hook them up. So there's a lot of wires under this table. So um, back here, that's just some styrofoam to give that a bit more of, a, of an elevation. Um, some of the historic landmarks. That church over there is the only piece that's, well, it's Apartment 56. It's not actually Dickens Village. That's the Cathedral of St. Paul that comes from Christmas in the city. I just liked it. Um, and there's a little cemetery back there and you could see the gross uh, the ghost of christmas yet to come and showing him showing scrooge's his grave ramsford palace that was a, a hot item back in i think 95 or 96 it's amazing how the values of these things have gone down that was probably i think 175 dollars when it was released and it was marked up to over 600 almost immediately but they go for a fraction of that now on ebay that platform in the back there, it is actually Department 56. Um, I you know, bought it from a display from a, a Hallmark shop where I, I occasionally buy pieces and uh, never actually been able to, to find any details on it, but it does have, you, you really can't see it, a Department 56 logo on it. Let me squeeze some more buildings into a street. Back here, Kensington Palace, integrated, I think it was called Victorian Garden into there and then just coming around here a bit more rustic um, I have plans for a two-foot extension with a um, with a park um, I've got you know, all the it all sized out all the parts listed but I just ran out of room there's a wall no more room so any more expansion and I've got to move anyway I've been collecting since 1993 so you know going on 30 years. It's uh, it's a lot of fun to put it up. I do take it down every year. Um, I like, you know, you know, spending those couple of days putting
putting it all together before you know the Christmas season starts kind of you know gets us all going here for the for the holidays it does stink to take it down if uh, any of you put up a large village and you put it up and take it down every year you know that taking it down is not fun at all so um, any questions about this or again any anything here where you're interested to learn more just uh, you know leave me a comment and I'll do my best to respond quickly all right thanks for watching Merry Christmas